direct here now. Used to be BHS. And we got the old cinema used to be there, Hippodrome. That's gone. Of empty shops, it's a shame. So this place here used to be Sayers, then it was Pound Bakery. Yeah, now it's shut. Bill <laughs> Talbot, whoever remembers this, it's closed now. Who remembers when this place was wimpy at first, then a Burger King? I used to meet my friends outside here on a Saturday. Meet you at Wimpy. Meet you outside Burger King. Some other days. So there in front of me used to be Marks and Spencer. Then there's been a few things, then QD, now, now it's closed again. Yeah, a lot of things have gone.
This here, who remembers this? Used to be our price. You can get all the CDs and tapes from here back in the day. Horse and jockey still there. Remember that used to be Woolworths, way back when, there's been a few things lately, in Poundland or something like that, and now it's one below, yeah, it's the old Woolworths. Remember when the silence grew so big it pushed a whole street through the sky? the pebble fish bar there looks like it's closed that was a popular chippy so this was the back of woolies if you remember that Turned into a Chinese buffet for a while, but it's nothing anymore. And up there is towards um, King Street bus station. So I just took a little walk around Wrexham. Um, hope you enjoyed that. Hope it brought back a bit of memories for some. So we're going to go back to T Paub. Uh, to, uh, Winking and just desserts and milkshakes. So come and join me. Let's have a feast. Let's see if it's lovely.
time? Yeah. Oh, beautiful. Thank you very much. Oh, food's right. So I've got barbecue wings, fries, I got chicken burger, regular, ten dozen fries, kids meal, kind of panta, 21 pound total. Good, in my opinion, for all this quality food. Right, have a look. Nice and freshly made. 
lovely chicken wings, chips, yeah, crispy, nicely cooked, chicken burger, very nice, very tasty. Yeah, so that's the Wing King, T Pal, Rexel. I'm also going to try chicken korma, uh, wild rice, some naan bread. It's from T Pal also, curry on the go. There's a lot of uh, eateries in here. So come down and try them all. So, yeah, chicken korma, first off, have a look. I don't eat it all myself. So we've got a full size waffle, Nutella sauce, and Kinder Bueno. All warm. This is from um, just desserts and milkshakes. Lovely and warm. Right, have a closer look. Mm. 
Nice soft vanilla ice cream. So, it's as good as it looks. So, if you want one of these, get yourself down to just desserts and milkshakes in T Pow, uh, Rexham. It's got to be a 10. Got to be. See you later. already support all these local businesses businesses Palp. So T Palp is not just an art museum or anything like that. It's um you can watch football or there's rugby in there today being shown. Uh Welsh rugby. You've got the Rex and match on this Tuesday coming up. Uh, the replay. That's gonna be screened in there. So yeah, it's not just a museum or an art gallery. There's a load of um, lovely eateries independent businesses in there uh, that need your support so get yourself down here so if you like that video give me a thumbs up subscribe it's free and hit the notification bell and that'll tell you uh, when i upload new videos thanks again guys i'll see you on the next one used to be called rex and baths uh, and water world so there it is with its unique shape So the police station was over there in the background, but it's gone now. Got demolished. Yeah, there it is. So it's still here. Yeah, so Rex and Water World. It's owned by Freedom Leisure now. Yeah, the police station was in the distance there, just around here. Yeah, it's been demolished now. <laughs>